Hi guys, today I will be getting ready as the new girl. 7.20. I was new to school like three months, no, a month ago. I don't know, but we're still gonna be getting ready as the new girl, so. It is currently 7.20. My school starts at 8.30. I'm making good on time, but actually, I need a scrunchie. I look a little, little ragamuffin, but it is time to get ready. Let me tell you guys how it is to be the new girl. So, my school, is like really really big i like i always see new people every single day for one thing i'm not popular so for some reason they won't treat me like bella swan and i'm a little confused it's not like being a new girl is like something new i was actually new in a school in texas but then i moved like a month later my cousin does go to the school so it made it less awkward when it comes to lunch time because like you know being alone at lunch, having no friends, but she actually has a lot of friends. So I'm cool with them, but we don't really talk. I only see her friends when we're in class together, which I do have a class with my cousin. It's really not that bad. It's not as bad as usual because I usually have like zero friends on the first few days, but you know, like I have somebody to talk to. My classes are really, really good. And it's just like regular classes. I do have a few other friends like in PE and stuff, but like I don't really talk to anybody outside of PE. Let me tell you guys, people are probably gonna be talking about you. Not like in a bad way, but just like, oh, like who is she? Like stuff like that. It took me a long time to make friends because for example, like in PE, these group of boys were talking about something and I just said something to their conversation and they were like, who the is that? It doesn't really like affect me. Like that's the part about like making friends. You kind of have to join their conversation of already made friends and then you create a friend group. Like you have to talk when they're not talking to you. You know what I'm trying to say? But it's like, you never know if that person is like ghetto or just rude and like just don't even want you in their conversation. So it's kind of like hard. You have to see, would they mind if I just said a little thing and chimed in? or are they gonna be rude about it? It doesn't really matter to me because like all I really need is my cousin, so I'm all good. I don't have a brush for my eyebrows because why don't I, I don't even know. Being the new girl is always a fun experience. I've been the new girl like eight times probably. I would recommend being the new girl that I love being the new girl because you just get to like do whatever you want with your personality. Like, coming from a school that I've been to for five years, it was relieving being the new girl because at that school, I was just seen as, like, the quiet girl because I started off as quiet. You can. You can always change throughout the years. But it's, like, I don't know. It's harder for me because, like, I've always been this way. So people are going to treat me like I've been this way. So I can't be a different way. I don't know if that makes sense, but that's just how it is for me. So coming to a new school has definitely like changed everything. So like my talkative side more because of my cousin. We're in the same English class. Like we don't sit next to each other. We literally sit like right across, like we're diagonal from each other. But like even a few days ago, I was making a joke with my cousin and this girl was sitting right next to me who sits next to me in English. She heard it and she was like laughing. When I was saying it, I didn't think like about it because you know it's just me and my cousin talking like usual but since she heard the joke like she now talks to me like i would recommend if you're like a shy person i would recommend going to a school with your cousin but if you can't like um maybe college or something i don't know they do integrated math over in california which i didn't even know about since i was new like some of the things that they learn in integrated math we didn't learn in algebra 2 so i didn't have to two of the quizzes in the beginning of when i started school i didn't have to do them and so i just had to do this like easy delta math and it was just like very very simple stuff like that like it's cool I forgot about this my classes are like all good and my first day of school was pretty good like i didn't really do anything because like i said new girl perks like yeah i feel like being the new girl is kind of also about rebranding yourself because you could just do whatever you want with yourself because it's a new school nobody knows you you can if you want to make videos in school you could do that as the new girl because coming from your old school people already know you they'll probably like 
oh, she thinks that she could be YouTube famous, all that type of stuff. But then if you do it at a new school, it could be like, oh my gosh, she's new. Is she YouTube famous? Like something like that. I'm gonna put on some lip plumper. Basically, my cousin's friends are just my acquaintances. Like, we don't really talk because we don't have any classes together. Like, I see them during passing period and we hug each other, we say hi and stuff, but it's not like we're like friends, friends. Like, they, if they were going to a party, they would only invite Jade. They wouldn't invite me. Like, we'll say hi to each other, maybe talk a little bit, but it's not like doing a lot. Are you guys excited for the summer? Like, let me know. This is turning to me just like blabbing about things, but I mean, you're watching the video, so. I don't know if I'm gonna put blush on. I just need to wait for this lip plumper to like dry. Wear a lipstick. The people at my school, it's like way different from my last school. I feel like it's more involved and more inclusive. So it's like really good. And the people are really like, they're actually really nice. Yeah, so I would recommend going to a new school. I feel like everybody should go to a new school every once in a while, especially in their high school years just for like a new experience because you've been in the same exact environment like your whole life i just i can't deal with that like i don't even understand how people can stay in one school like from elementary junior high then high school all with the same exact people that's just insane to me i feel like you should move around a little bit like you've been in the same exact area you've seen the same exact people of course there's going to be new people but you've seen the majority are the same exact people your whole entire life like that's just like you need a new environment and being a new girl um i feel like it could be overhyped at times but most of the things are pretty true like obviously you won't be like bella swan like up in the school people kissing and loving on you um you can be popular sometimes eighth grade there was this new guy and his name was going all around the school because he was so like fine like stuff like that does actually happen but it's not it's not like all about what you think but like starting over and stuff and like changing your personality is like true if you guys have any questions leave it down below if you guys want to know anything leave it down below I'm trying to take up the hair which i actually like like maybe if i did this good all right i'll see you guys all in the next one i love you guys and make sure to follow the socials like i said leave it in a comment down below if you guys have any questions um like and subscribe if you want to see more get ready with me's and i'll see you guys on the next one bye